What is up guys, it's Techno Spider and today I'm bringing you guys another Origins video showing you guys how to get the Thunder Fists, which is a new melee weapon in Origins and it's really awesome, I just can't wait to show you guys how to get this. So we need to fill up these four boxes which are located around the map. As you can see when you shoot a zombie by the box, their soul goes and flies into the box. I basically need to fill up all four of these boxes and then go to a challenge box which can be located at Generator 6 or the Spawn Room. And you'll be able to open one of the similar looking boxes and claim your reward, which will end up being the Thunder Fist. So the first location is right over here behind Juggernaut. I'm sure you guys know this place. This is kind of a good spot to hold out. But unfortunately, a robot does step at this spot. As with all the other spots in this map, there's always room for a robot to step in each one of these, which makes it kind of hard. But it's always nice to make sure that you're looking out for robots as they do come and they will kill you if you guys are not prepared. So you'll know that you have filled up the box completely because it will close and shoot up into the sky like we see now. So now that we have filled that one up, we are going to move over to our next location. Okay guys, so our next location is right here next to the excavation site. This is also a place where the robot can step, which is the Odin bot, which is the bot that controls the middle of the map. You can tell which bots are controlling the map is because if you're facing the bots, like they're coming towards you and you're not behind them, you're facing them. The one on the right, the far right, is the Thor bot and he'll go over by generator 3 and 2. The one in the middle is the Odin bot and he'll come right through the map by the activation site. And the one to the left is Freya and it's the bot that patrols the church area. So just letting you guys know that, but as you can see we're just filling up this box and it's the same as the other ones and I will point out that this is easier with more people because you can like have one person at each box and they can each just fill up their own individual box or you can all go together to one box. This doesn't take too long guys, it only took us about three rounds to do all the boxes and we're on really low rounds too. But now we're going to be able to move on to our third and fourth locations. Okay guys, so the next location is right over here at Power Station 5. We're going to run right to the right of it, or left depending on which side you're coming in from. And it's right there. Watch out, because again, Odin can step in this area. But it's not that hard to do, just like all the other ones. You just got to keep a watchful eye out for the robot, and have decent weapons to hold out. And this box is really easy. So now we can move on to our fourth box, and then we will be able to get the Thunder Fists. Okay guys, so for the last location, you just want to go right in front of the church right here, right outside of where the tank can go through. And there's our last box location. Freya can step in this area, so watch out for her, like all the other areas. But this is the last area, so once you have this place filled with souls, or this box filled with souls, we are going to be able to go and get the almighty Thunder Fists. So now that we have completed all our boxes, we can head over to the back of the church by Generator 6, and there's a reward box. I know you have completed all boxes because you'll see a token above your perks. And as you can see here, after capturing the thing, we get our elemental staff. But I'm going to open the box again, and a orangish orb will fly out of the box. And now you have Thunder Fist. You do this really awesome animation, and then you just punch them with air. You can actually take out three to four zombies at a time with this, and they're more powerful than Galva Knuckles. And they last till round 19. It's not as good as the Golden Spark, but it's like in between the Golden Spark and the Golden Knuckles. And they're really awesome, guys. I hope this video helped you out. Leave a like because it was kind of hard for us to get this to work, but we finally did it. Subscribe if you guys would like to see more Origins content because I'm working around the clock to put out the best videos out there right now about Origins. But until next time, guys, this has been Techno Spider, and I will see you all later.